So we are no longer in hot shots. What's up, YouTube family? He the one that woke me up and told me that it's glow time Some people get put on and then they lost their whole mind Character before to come up now he'll say he'll blow mine So, I know, I know It has been a while since I have been on here I am here to quickly give you guys some life updates To let you guys know what's been going on in our lives There has been so many changes Honestly, I kind of don't know where to start right now, but I'll just try to give you guys a quick rundown. I'm not going to make this video long. I just want to come in and say hey to you guys. I'm currently filming from my laptop. Hopefully, I can order a new camera soon and start vlogging more. So I should be able to balance my schedule a bit better, but... Let's start off. Let's start off with a few of the life changes that have been going on. So, as you see in the title, we are no longer doing hotshot. That's right, Hubby is no longer a hotshot truck driver. It's officially an over the road semi truck CDL holder truck driver so I mean that deserves a round of applause Woo! we made it out of the hotshot game I don't know if you guys know but our goal was to never stay in hotshot it was a stepping stone now the business is still there it's still up and running we are still doing trucking all the way I'm actually not taking any drivers for dispatching right now. We're at capacity when it comes to that, but I will try to drop the link here. Uh, I may not drop the link here. YouTube has been acting funny with the links, but uh, shoot me an email. You can either email me at info at straightpathdispatch.com. You can go to our website, straightpathdispatch.com, or you can email straightpathdispatch at gmail.com and I will send you the link to sign up for our waitlist. Okay, so that's the trucking news. Um, now, this, you know, despite all of these transitions and blessings that we've been receiving in our lives, I try to be fully transparent with you guys. When I started this channel, that was my goal, to be fully transparent. And so I want to say that there is a lot of things going on in the trucking industry. A lot of things are put on pause. I've lost a lot of good trucks in the trucking industry because they've had to close down their business with the rates being so horrible. So I am just praying over all of you in the trucking industry. Um, praying that number one you're already doing well and you're continuing to do well number two if you are going through some hard times I'm praying that you get through it and you will get through it God is good he's amazing and he will always be there despite other people so with that being said with me being transparent the hot shot just wasn't working out for us anymore it was that time to move on from that uh, position in life um, we had a couple other financial difficulties going on with the businesses with the kids and you know I just had to take a break from YouTube number one I have a two-year-old so you know that alone is a lot plus our other children our other older children um, so hubby and I just had to you know regroup start over and um you know now we're just pushing forward um so we are no longer in hot shot but hot shot is still there i still help with coaching advice 
anything that you guys need with Hotshot. I do still do my trucking consultations, so feel free to go to the website. I still have um, ebooks that you can purchase. We're still up and running, so there's that. That's the trucking side of things, right? Now let's move on to updates with family. Now, before you go there, no, I'm not having any other kids at the moment. But we transitioned into a new home, so I'll probably be updating uh, with cleaning videos. You know, this channel, this channel really started out as a, you know, stay-at-home mom, cleaning, baby update, family life channel and it slowly transitioned into a trucking channel because that became my life right <laughs> that's our livelihood and because i was doing that from home and balancing it you know i started to transition to all things trucking and it's great content i mean it's something that anyone can get into and make money with without having to go to school, have a degree, without having to have all these qualifications, and you can make good money in it. So, of course, it's great content, but the channel was originally made to give that versatility, right? Give that family life, that balance. So, things were hectic for me. But as things slow down, I'm going to slowly bring back that balance to you guys. So content with family life, content with work, content with the businesses. So stay tuned for that. Now, I also want to quickly throw in that I did start another business endeavor. So if you're a work from home, mom, dad, anything, or if you go out to work and you just want to generate passive income, I have something for you. So go to my website here at learnbusinesswithshan.com, sign up there and you will get information on generating passive income from home without doing anything. That is one of the things when I quit working for corporate America that I strive to do and the trucking helped out a little bit, but it still took a lot of me. So go to that website check that out and I'll be sending lots of updates throughout that website channel to help you guys in passive income. But yeah, the video was not meant to be super long. So I hope you all are doing well. I hope everyone is hanging in there. Um, you know, I don't want to rant too much with this, but you guys, if you've been following me for a while, you know I am very big on faith. And if you are a Christian during these times, times are going to be hard. Times are going to be rough. And we just got, we just got, we just have to consistently stay in prayer, stay connected to the Holy Spirit stay connected to God who is within us because that is the only way you are going to survive these times. Unfortunately, I heard some awful news yesterday that one of my great friends and ex-co-workers sadly passed away. He was one of my biggest supporters, one of my amazing friends. A huge bubbly personality very loving very caring and he was a believer in faith as well and it hurts me to see you know people like that go because you know they're just so amazing they're a light to this world and unfortunately his light has gone out in this world and I know he's in a better place with God but it just hurts and I'm telling you guys all this to say that life is very short life is very short and as times go on as we get closer to the end of things because you know God has a beginning and he has an end and there's a time that we're going to be called home there's a time when everything that you've seen in the book of revelations if you're reading your bible it's going to come to pass 
and we just have to stay strong and connected to the Holy Spirit. We have to not let fear take over. We have to not let demonic spirits and darkness take over in our minds. It's all a mind thing, right? So you have to start with positivity each day. If you're feeling negative and you're feeling down, lean into the Holy Spirit for support, for strength, for guidance. I'm telling you, I've had some dark times this past year. This year has been a true testament of my faith. And I had to lean into the Holy Spirit. And I had to get my strength from Him. God has kept me in hiding so that I can continue to develop myself, continue to develop and nurture my family, and continue to be there for my husband. So, you know... Sometimes you just have to lean in to the Holy Spirit in those dark times, and He will lead you through. He'll lead you through. It will be tough. I call this year a wilderness year, right? So if you ever get a chance to open your Bible, read that story in Exodus, that wilderness journey, and see how God takes you through the wilderness and brings you into your promised land. But when you're going through that wilderness, you have to be very discerning. Don't fall into temptations. Don't fall into the spirit of complaining or negativity because it can hinder your blessings. I know for a fact because I've gone through that. But anyways, I'm not going to go too much into that. I'll save that for other videos. Um, but I just wanted to let you guys know we're still here. We're still going. Um, I hope everyone is doing well. And I will catch you guys in the next video. But keep going strong. Keep the faith. Peace, the love, and all the above. I'm out. Just trying to show her how to vlog because apparently, you know. Oh my gosh, my face is like, it's horrible. Yeah, we should do, we should, they should pay us extra to do the DCF vlog. So we can this is officially a DCF vlog, okay? Let me show you how exciting this job is. You ready? I'm the best to with it. I've been different my whole life since a child with it Show me if you do it all for God Yeah, that's my mission All the underdogs got a voice Now I'm loud with it Mama told me humility early I'm not proud with it Confidence is when you have the knowledge That it's God when it I work hard to justify the zeros in the checks Written gold in my mouth Got a first place Smile with it Of course the eagles and the pigeons Gonna fly different I've been different my whole life Since a child with it Show me if you do it all for God Yeah, that's my mission All the underdogs Dogs got a voice, now I'm loud with it. I'ma talk to humility early. I'm not proud with it. Confidence is when you have the knowledge that it's God when it. I work hard to justify the zeros in the checks. Written gold in my mouth, got a first place. Smile with it. Of course, the eagles and the pigeons gon' fly different. I'm the best around with it. Yeah, I know you heard me. Like I'm David Goggins, cause you really can't hurt me. Like my name was Giannis, 34 on the jersey. Respect was never given, I had to earn it. Locked in, only way I've ever been, I never had an option. I'm not gonna stop until the top of the top ten. Fearless, regardless, I gotta leave a legacy. I'm a role model so the kids can be a better me. Big dog in this, huh, huh, check the pedigree. Show them my consistency so they'll never get ahead of me. Hard work, God first, yeah, that's the recipe. Gotta show the world of it. I'm the best around with it. I've been different my whole life since a child with it. Show them they could do it all for God. Yeah, that's my mission. All the underdogs got a voice. Now I'm loud with it. Mama told me humility early. I'm not proud with it. Confidence is when you have the knowledge that it's God with it. I work hard to justify the zeros in the checks. Written gold in my mouth. Got a first place. Smile with it. Of course, the eagles and the pigeons gonna fly different.